Yo, what's up guys, today I'm showing you Matrix Client for a Minecraft Bedrock Edition right over here to get this. It is going to be linked right down in the description below. Although, as you can see, it is already in my downloads. And so all I need to do is inject it with my favorite injector. Of course, that is Fate. I will link it down in the description below. And bam, we can click on inject and we have now injected Matrix Client. We've got it. It's literally that simple. Matrix works for 1.21.2, which is a version of 1.21, so it's kind of recent, although it isn't really that recent at the same time. However, if you would like to learn how to downgrade, if you don't know that yet, I will link a tutorial for that in the description below too. So you've got everything to get you started with using Matrix Client. So let's check it out. As you can see, I am in a dire survival situation here. All of these items I obviously obtained completely legit and not through creative mode because I'm an actual serious Minecraft player. Anyways, as you can see, I've got Matrix Client enabled and there's a few cool things already we've got by default enabled an array list in the bottom right hand side and on the middle of the left side we've got this little radar over here which is displaying some stuff nobody got three Robbie from that count anyways I loaded into a random world and I'm not sure why I had a diamond pickaxe and three hearts but it looks good to me so basically we can press on the insert button on our keyboards and that is going to open up the matrix client click gui let me know down in the comments to place your bets for what client this is skidded off of or if it's not skidded off of anything either way it's a pretty impressive client just look at the amount of utilities it has definitely enough stuff that is going to be able to help me out over here in survival mode uh yeah, there's so much in this client. Definitely go ahead and check it out. Really, especially the HUD is also quite extensive, and that just matches the incredible amount of utilities that this client has. I was quite surprised when I opened it up for the first time. Anyways, of course, it doesn't let us down on the commands, um, although apparently there is no help command. Like, that's kind of a trend nowadays. But of course, we can still use stuff like dot bind, click GUI, and then F over here, and now I can press on F to open and close the click GUI instead of the insert button, which uh, I know some of you guys don't have the insert button on your keyboard. So that is how to rebind that. Of course, all the other commands work as well. We've got the dot config command, the dot friend command. You guys know how it is. Anyways, for right now though, that was uh, basically that. Thank you all ever so much for watching, and I do of course hope to see you again in the next one. Bye-bye.